everyone. How are you? Do you remember the last story? Yeah, we ran to the big trees. And at the end, there was a large fountain rising up to the sky. So who is the new friend we will meet today? Are you excited? Yes? So let's go on a story trip. Suddenly, a rabbit appeared behind the fountain. The rabbit told the two kids, Hi! I am so glad that two new friends came to see me. Isn't this fountain beautiful? Let's play here together. The rabbit skipped happily. When the children saw the rabbit running, they played together and said, we are really happy to meet you. Yes, suddenly the rabbit appeared from behind the fountain. Everyone, do you like rabbits? I really like them. Please, let's draw a cute rabbit together. First, draw the rabbit's ears. Draw the rabbit's ears as two long ovals and draw smaller ovals inside. The ears are long, aren't they? Rabbit ears are long like this. And I will draw a circle face here. Yes, and draw the eyes. I'll draw the eyes darker with this brown color. It's a new kind of face. This is a frowning face. Draw the mouth like this and next draw the nose this way. And you can draw the mouth like this. I'll color it in lightly. And let's color the cheeks red, shall we? Yes, and then I'll draw the body. The body is bigger than the head. You can draw a circle. And next draw the belly that's smaller than the body. And you can draw its hands over here in circles like the ears. Difficult, isn't it? And I'll draw the feet as sideways ovals like this. And the hands. I've drawn the palms and the fingers as small circles. You can show the feet by making rounded lines. Yeah, I'm trying to show that the rabbit is holding a carrot. Carrots are a little bit rounded and triangular. Please draw this as if it is a rounded triangle. And draw the grass on top. Yes, and now I'll color the rabbit. Now let's color the rabbit's ears pink. We will color the inside part of the ears with a different color later. Please color the other ears inside pink too. Color the face pink.
I'll color the body too. And I'll color the belly here in the middle of the body with a different color. Yeah, I colored the body pink so beautifully. So I'll color the hands. And this hand. Then I'll color the feet. Yes! Then I will paint the rest of the ears and the belly in yellow. And the hands. Oh, the rabbit has a yellow belly and yellow hands. It is so very cute. It is very pretty to see yellow and pink used together. Next, I'll color the carrot. How about coloring the carrot orange? There, that's done. Shall we color in the background then? Let's color in the background using simple patterns. You can draw it how you like. I'm drawing a triangle. There, there's a triangle. A triangle has three points. And let's draw a small triangle here and a much smaller triangle here. I'll draw them in different directions. Can you see them? Yes, so all of them are triangles, but their shapes are slightly different. And they have different sizes and different directions. Please draw the triangles as you like. And with all the triangles together, it looks much better. Then also using sky blue, please draw some triangles. I'll use a red color too. Yes! Wow! The rabbit seems to be having a lot more fun now than when there was nothing. Don't you think so? Now, next I'm going to use some paint. So, prepare the paints and other materials. A water dish, a brush, and a palette and dip the brush in the water. Each of you have your favorite colors. So let's check the colors we have on this palette and then start painting. I'll try to paint with yellow. On the bottom. This time I'm not going to fill it all in, but I'm going to paint just by making some lines. Yes, and here too. It's very nice to feel the lines when you make them with the paint on the brush. Now I will mix some other colors. Shall we blend in orange? Like the rabbit's favorite food, carrot color. I'll try to put the orange over the yellow like this. If 
the water and paint runs out, don't forget, keep putting them back on your brush. Yes, and I'll fill in the spaces around the rabbit. Yes, now we've painted in the background. It's done, everyone. I guess the rabbit will want to give the carrot to the boy and girl. Yes, so try to draw a rabbit's ears very long. Or maybe you want to draw them little like this. Well, you can draw and paint as you like. I had a good time today. So I'll meet you all again next time. Bye!